unboxing is three picture books that I got from North South and it looks like it's a series. Um, what Hedgehog Likes Best Rhymes for Children by Erwin Mosier. What Cat Likes Best Rhymes for Children, Erwin Mosier. And What Bear Likes Best. So looks like they're like perfectly square picture books and they're not, they're like small. Like, there's my hand. Um, so it's like nice, it's like, uh, it will fit little hands. Okay, what Bear likes best, it's translated from German, I think. North South does a lot of books in translation. It's from Germany. And I think that's interesting because translating rhymes from one language to another is actually very tricky, you know, because the words are different. And when you translate it, it doesn't necessarily rhyme. So from one language to the other, it's actually pretty incredible. Okay, so this is about what bear likes best. What does bear like best? Bear likes simple things. Eagle sitting on her nest, a walk is what bear loves best. And here the bear is anthropomorphic with a cane. The parrot's longing to be free. The little chick says, look at me. Zebra stripes are black and white. Spiders hungry day and night. So it's just sort of random, like um, small moments. And a little bit quirky. Does Cat also like small moments? What does Cat like? Cats are waiting for their tea. The mouse says, please don't look at me. So that it's not necessarily things related to the animal as much as these just little observations of nature. And Hedgehog also. So the character who is telling us what they like looks like they're anthropomorphic. Although here's a, a mouse that's anthropomorphic. But, um, and a hamster also. But some of them are just in nature. It's just quirky. But it has a nice, um, easy to say rhyme, a nice short rhyme. So it's gonna be great for literacy, teaching kids how to read because rhyming is a great way to learn words because you can predict the word based on the context and knowing that it's going to rhyme. And the illustrations also give it a clue. And the illustrations have kind of a timeless quality. It has a real old fashioned feel, the series. Um, but I think it's, I think it's quite, it's quite new. Well, actually, no, he made stories since 1980, but I don't know when this one was written. Um, anyway, three rhyming picture books that rhyme. Thank you to North South, and thank you all for watching.